Hi, I'm Michael Tennant. 2014 has been another very busy year for Territory businesses. With a national focus on developing Northern Australia, the Territory has stepped up to the plate and is taking the lead. It seems that nearly every week there has been another announcement of a new project, a new development, a new conference or a new opportunity has presented itself to the Territory and to our businesses. Businesses across the NT are gaining national recognition for their hard work and outstanding achievements. Most recently, Arafura Tree Services was named Small Employer of the Year at the National Training Awards. At the same event, our Amy Williams was awarded runner-up Vocational Student of the Year for her achievements in completing certificates in fitness through Charles Darwin University. Congratulations to all the NT finalists who travelled to Adelaide for the awards last month. This month, the Territory is reflecting on the 40th anniversary of Cyclone Tracy. The department has collected stories from business owners and businesses at the time and released a book called Tracy Tales. Many of the people in the book are still in business today and their stories are truly both hair-raising and inspirational. Innovation is an important part of a successful business. Right now, we are offering innovation grants of up to $60,000 to support businesses to commercialise their ideas. In this month's Business Bulletin, you'll also read about how October Business Month 2014 broke all records, and also about how your business can get involved as OBM attempts to outdo itself next year for its 21st birthday. Also celebrating a big milestone in 2015 will be the NT Training Awards. They'll be celebrating 60 years of awarding excellence in the NT vet sector. Maybe your business has been involved in the past. We'd love to hear from you as we mark this very special occasion. Our defence support team manages the annual Anzac Spirit Study Tour. The tour helps keep the Anzac Spirit alive in today's youth. On Remembrance Day, four young Territorians were awarded a trip to Gallipoli to represent the NT at the Anzac Centenary Dawn Service. Congratulations to Amy, Jack, Stevie and Juliet. The NT Parliament has passed a major licensing reform. A new streamlined approach will see the introduction of a Director General of Licensing to replace the NT Licensing Commission. The Director General will oversee all decisions from the 1st of January to improve timeliness for licensees. These important reforms will reduce red tape, cost to businesses and improve processing timeframes. Another big change in the wind is the proposed changes to the workers' compensation scheme. The government has just announced its responses to recommendations from an independent review. These are available on the NT WorkSafe website for people to view. I take this opportunity to acknowledge the efforts of my teams across the department that have worked hard this year to deliver services to the business community and industry in the Territory and the changes we are doing to improve how we do business with you. The Department of Business will be shutting down between Christmas and New Year, but essential staff will still be available during the period. And on behalf of the Department of Business, we wish you, your families, your colleagues, and all of our clients a very happy and safe festive season and a prosperous 2015. Thank you.